Look at the stars. Look how they shine for you. And everything that they do. Because they're all footy players. Look at the cards. Look how they are in my hands. And I've got a letter to. Because this is more footy cards. Doom, 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 doom. Sounds nothing like it. Welcome back to Albert the Top. My name is Adam, and today we're going to be opening up some footy cards. Surprise, surprise. Also, I got a letter. Haha. <laughs> and also inside here, I've got a select highlight, the first Richmond select highlight of the year, which is, of course, the Shea Bolton quote unquote mark of the year contender, which, thanks to voting, uh, is not actually in the running to be one of the marks of the year because it got beaten by uh, Majacek of the Pies. Looks like the uh, Collingwood supporters came out in force as far as voting goes. <sighs> Look, I'll go deeper into that when we open it up. But let's first, let's do something first. Let's crack this open. This is my address. If you want to send me anything, this is where you can get me Adam Horn, Parcel Locker, blah, 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 Shop 2, blah, 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 Ringwood, blah, 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 etc., etc. This is from somebody who's drawn a very cool goal. Does that look like to you the goals, It's the ball has been kicked out from out? Like, Because obviously this is where it's come from. So, like, because that's generally the trail of where the ball comes from. So, it looks like the football goals has actually kicked the footy out. No? Yes? Maybe? This is from somebody. Let's crack it open. Ha-cha! Let's see what's inside. Uh, probably Richmond stuff. Let's face it. There is nothing beyond there. Um, let's have a look inside here. There's probably a Richmond card in here or two. I have no idea. I can't remember my wheelings and dealings. How dare you try to suggest I keep track of the things that I'm doing. Oh, it's not a Richmond one. However, we are in some for some goodness. Bam! It's the back, it's the back of a Star Wild. Oh, I made some trades. Here we are. Ka-chow, Ben Cunnington Star Wild card from the North Melbourne Kangaroos. I don't remember what I traded for. Not going to lie. I've definitely sent this one out, though. I, I'm pretty sure I've sent this one out. Let's have a look at it. Let's have a look at the corners. Is it good looking? Let's get some um, a bit of uh, focus on that. There we go. Ooh, yeah, this is a beautiful card. This is definitely straight from the pack into a sleeve. Thank you so much. Uh, I can't remember who sent this to me. I cannot remember. But, ka I also got a bump and... A bump and... A bump and bump and bump and bump and I can't speak anymore. A bump star power, which is very exciting. However, I'm realizing that I've probably revealed the uh, the code on the back. So, at some point, uh, you might have a random cut in this video where I've accidentally shown that... I can't get this card out. The code... Ah, oh, okay. Well, there we go. There we go. Did you know that I've only pulled... The only uh, green star powers I have pulled have come out of full boxes, which are guaranteed. There's one in each box. I haven't actually pulled, just by randomness, a green star power yet. That is a beautiful card. Bonds, I, th I think Bonds at the moment, argue me if you will, I think Bonds at the moment is leading the Brownlow votes. I reckon when we get to round, what are we up to, round eight or nine by now? But right now, right round now, round 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 nine. I reckon the Bonds is leading the Brownlow votes. Now I am recording this on the um, no, that's good cards. I can't remember what I traded. Cannot remember what I traded for that. It was definitely for a wild card. I think it may have been for Charlie. I think it may, I may have sent Charlie um, out and abouts into the world um, and some ugh, some other stuff. I, I don't remember. But thank you so much for that wonderful trade. I love that, and that builds up my wild my Star Wild card collection. Let's do these ones next. Um, I am recording this on the Tuesday night before the next round. So uh, when you see this video, it will be Saturday. So I've recorded this a few days before. Um, let's just peel this open. And uh, we've just announced inside Melbourne that we are getting more restrictions, which means that is leaving completely up in the air, the, um, the football for the weekend. Is there going to be games on? Is there not going to be games on? Obviously, by the time you see this video, you're going to know the answer to that. However, past Adam... In, as in Tuesday, Adam, doesn't know the answer to that as of yet. Uh, inside here is going to be the first Richmond highlight of the year. Now, I actually ordered two. So what I'm going to do, last year I ordered only ordered one of the each card. This year I'm going to order uh, two of each card. I've already ordered the dusty one that came out as a highlight against the Giants. 
Um, so that one's already on its way. But this is the share one. You ready? Ka-chow! Upside down. Wow, he took that mark upside down. How good is that? There we go. The mark of the year contender. 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 Unfortunately, it wasn't actually nominated for the mark of the year. Somehow. I'm sorry, Collingwood supporters. But this was by far, by far, a much better mark than uh, Maya Check's mark that round. That was insane. Insane, insane, insane. This is this should be 100% in the running. I don't think it'll win Mark of the Year. I don't think it would have, would have won Mark of the Year. However, it should at least have been in contention. This it was easily the best mark of that round. There was a lot of good marks taken. However, Collingwood supporters came out in force. And uh, maybe just that Richmond hate came out as well for, for Shea Bolton. Um, and unfortunately, he did not get nominated. Now, I've ordered two. Let's crack these open. Let's see what numbers... We are looking at now Shea Bolton. We're looking for uh, what's his what's his um uh, what's his uh, jumper number? Um, 29, 29. His number is twenty nine. So we're looking for number twenty nine on either of his packs. Let's see what number we get on the first one. Kachow! We have got. 512 of 552. That is a very, very low number as far as the cards go. In fact, there's only 40 other cards after that one. Let's see if we can improve our number. That one, what do, you, what do we got to beat? 512. Now, I've never ordered two. I wonder if we get consecutive cards. I don't think we will, but let's find out. ka -chow! 248. We definitely improved there. However, none of those are a jumper number in the 24. Sorry, my, my, um, my focus is all over the place. I apologize for that. It is a beautiful card, though. It is a fantastic card. Look at that. Really great photograph being taken right there of the fantastic mark. But unfortunately, despite the card saying mark of the year contender, it wasn't nominated for mark of the year because that's just the way it is. That Richmond hate, I think, came out in a free-flowing force. Calling supporters, feel free to disagree with me. Anyone in the comments, feel free to disagree with me. I didn't mention, I haven't mentioned this on the on the um, on the channel before, but let me know. Do you think um, Brody Mychek's mark was better than Shea Bolton's that round? What round was it? It was round round eight. Go back, have a look at both of them. You decide who was the better mark, Mayacek or Shea Bolton. Up to you, your call. All right, let's get into some packs. I got five packs here. Now I haven't pulled, I've been talking about it recently, I haven't pulled a wild card or anything special for a long time. So I'm looking to break that drought. Also, I'm looking to zoom in. All right, Zorko, Jonas, my name is Jonas, Cameron, Queen Nala. We got Jack, Zebel, and Arez going to be a Dane Zorko in just the regular craft form. Glad I didn't show that code. That means I don't need to blur that part out. Um, I don't like the backward pack thing. Um, I think I got it though. You got to, I think with the backward packs, you have to turn it around first. If you turn it around first, then um, there's less likelihood of um, you revealing any codes from the Go Tigers, Jack Rewalt, uh, on the whole thing. So. Oh, wait, I think I've, oh, I don't know what I've done now. All right, let's see if I was correct. Jack Viney, Tom Papley, Jaden Short in the Richmond Best and Ferris. Go Tigers. I do need this one. I think I made a trade for somebody. However, that trade has possibly been lost to the world. Sometimes I make a trade and the card just never turns up. And then I've sent a card out and somebody else owns it. But I definitely need that one in beautiful form. And my gold, oh, double Richmond, Dion Prestia and Jaden Short. Actually, triple Richmond because we had a Jack Rewald in there as well. Three Richmonds in that card. Is that a sign of the future? Is that a sign of the weekend? Look, I'm not going to lie. I haven't even looked ahead. I can't remember who we're playing. If we're playing at all, are we how, Are we playing at all? Or if we're playing, we're playing in front of a crowd. I, I, I don't know. I don't know. It's supposed to be my son's birthday party this weekend. So uh, that's also been canceled because, you know, I can't have 70 plus people over to my house to celebrate my son's birthday. Um, hey, martial law. I definitely need that. That is very cool. I haven't seen that one yet in glitter or glow form. Hey, Rowan Marshall from the Saints. I need that one. And a Jaya Simkin in the gold. The Empress here. Go Tigers. Need that one. Good looking card. I'm slowly collecting the set. I've been a lot of, have had a lot of people requesting to do a um, binder folder. A binder folder? A, uh, a uh, folder, fold, uh, what do you call them? Binder update. Dustin Martin. Go Tigers. There is a lot of Richmond commons in these packs. Throw those over there. Look, guys. Lucky Neil. Charlie Dixon is a good set. Caleb Sarong. There you go. If you don't have the code for that. And a hey, Todd Goldstein. Friend of the channel. Favorite channel player of the channel in Goldstein. I'm seeing a lot of North Melbourne cards in here as well. Are you noticing a lot of North Melbourne and a lot of Richmond? That could just be me. But I'm noticing a lot of North Melbourne and a lot of Richmond. I have one pack left. Although I have more on the side. If I don't pull anything out of this, well, let's crack one more. Okay. 
All right, let's turn that one around. Jason Johannesson, Jamie Elliott, Andrew Gaff, Jaron Impey, Sean McAdam, and a rare's going to be... Hey, I haven't seen that one either. A Cognelio in the uh, the glow. Very cool looking uh, Cognelio right there. Actually, that's a not bad animation of him either. A, a cartoon of him either. I like that. Cooking, cooking cogs. I'd watch a Stephen Cornelio um, cooking show. Would you? I don't know if I would. Uh, let's go one more. Let's go one more because the luck has not been good recently. We haven't had a wild card pulled for a long time. We haven't had a green card pulled outside of a box ever. Um, since doing those car packs early, the car packs early on, we um, just haven't had that luck go our way. Let's see if we can change it around with this pack. Come on. Come on. Oh, nope. Not changing around the Matt Crouch in the odd bods. Can't remember if I need that one or not. And my name is Jonas. And an odd go Tigers in the end. Whoa, wow. Our pack luck has not been great recently. Let's zoom out a little bit. Our pack luck has been left a little to be desired. We're not going to lie on this. Do I need to go back to the car? Because that's where my early luck really was. Inside the cars. Do I need to go back to the cars? The short, I guess. Yeah, let's bring the short out. There we go. And we'll crack these ones. See, this is this is this was my highlight of my pack pulls, and then this is the stuff that I, you know, had coming anyway. <sighs> I'm telling you, I'm telling you. I think I need to go back to the car. That's where my luck was early on, guys. Remember those early car pack videos? I was pulling so many good things. Huh. I think we should return to the cars. Return to the car. Yep. Let's do that. But for now, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoy my content, please make sure you like and comment down below. If you're new to the channel or you haven't subscribed yet, I'd love if you can consider maybe hitting that bell icon and come along with me on my YouTube journey. I've got plenty more footy content come out as we go deeper into the season. And of course, very, very soon, once Pokemon cards start to arrive again in Australia, I might be able to start opening some Pokemon along with wrestling coming up and all that sort of fun stuff as well. But at the moment, definitely hunting these footy cards. But apart from all that, thank you, thank you, thank you so much for watching. Please make sure you're staying safe. Staying healthy, being amazing, and as always, I will. See you in the next one. It really should have been the Mark of the Year contender. I mean, they printed a card for it, just literally assuming that that was going to be the Mark of the Year contender, and it didn't come true. It didn't come true. Comments. I'm not bitter about it. It's it's fine, whatever. But, you know, Mark of the Year, eh, well, this doesn't matter. I'd rather the Tigers make the finals. However, it was such a good mark. Such a good mark. All right. See you later, guys.